I love it. What's going on, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, I want to quick show you guys how to enter uh, what I call a bracket order um, on the Weibo platform because I know a lot of you guys have been asking that question as to how do you um, secure profit and, and, and edit the order uh, while you are in the trade. So I want to show that to you guys today. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So uh, basically, if you are using the Weibo platform for trading like I do, uh, if you go under trade, you can see here you have your dashboard. So this is my dashboard and your dashboard is not going to look like this because this is my setup. Um, I think I have a video here on the channel that shows my exact setup or I might do another video just to show you guys. But this is my personal setup. So um, just to enter a simple order, there's multiple ways that you can go about doing that. Um, one would be you can use on the on the left side here, which is to me, it, it's an order entry form. So you can basically uh, choose, let's say buy, and then you, if you choose the type, the order type, if it's a limit order, you pick the limit order or market. I don't ever really use market order unless I really want to sell real quick and get out of a position, then I use the market order. Um, then, or if you say sell, then you can pick that, uh, and you have the option of also shorting. So that's um, the three options as far as um, what you can actually do. So let's say buy. Uh, once you have that, you enter your quantity, you enter your price, um, and then your time and force, um, and also your you decide if you want to do an extended hour or um, just uh, you know for the day. Extended hours will determine that you can you trade after the market closes. Um, in my case, three uh, p.m. Central. Um, so once you have that, you can then place uh, in that place. That's just a simple order, but um, to continue, you would have to put, um, you know, your stop loss and you take profit. So once you have that set up, you can determine. So, and this is a good thing about Weibo that I really like. As I input my number here in terms of dollar amount, it shows me how much I'm going to, I'm going to lose in this, this trade or how much I'm going to make. So I can adjust that number, um, accordingly. But here's another way that you can actually enter an order um, on the Weibo platform. So within within this chart right here, I just right click, and then so wherever I right click, that is where I can actually get in. So if I say new order, I can I can just click that and see the price where I clicked. That's where it gets filled over here, and so then I can input my information as needed. So I'm going to show you guys with a, uh, a simple example here and show you how the bracket order actually works and how uh, once I'm in, this is how I move that order around to secure profit. Um, and right now, um, I'm just looking at NIO. This setup is not really good. See that it got rejected uh, right on the VWAP here. And so I, ideally, this is not a good setup to trade. Uh, but for the purposes of this example, I might have to use this just to show you guys um, exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, let me see. I'm just going to go down here and see if there's any other stock that I think has a, a good setup. Um, not that I can see right here. So anyways, we're going to use this. So if we use NIO, I'm just going to buy maybe one or two shares just to show you guys this example. So if I use NIO and I see that, oh, this thing is approaching VWAP, but ideally you want it to like really break VWAP and show some consolidation. That is when you're doing a, great, a good trade. But in this case, again, like I said, this is just for, for this example. So um, I would pick where I want to get into the trade. So, oh man, see, that's why I said this is not a good setup because um, it's not breaking VWAP and holding. So uh, let's see, I might, I might have to look for a different example because I hate to make one example that would get us in trouble. I mean, I might lose a few dollars. Uh, no, yeah, a few dollars here, that's fine. I'll try it. Boy, it's keep, keep going down. It's not good. Uh, let's see. We can find something else. Uh, let's see this. Uh, which stock is this? Okay, let's see Square. So Square is like popping right now. So we can buy one share of Square just for the purposes of this video. Again, I'm going to put a tight stop loss just in case. So if I click right here at the bottom here at, I'll say 198, because right 198.54, because right trading at 198. Um, 
70, 86. So if I if I choose that order there, I I input my criteria. Let me move this on the side. So I want two shares, um, just in case. And then the price is one ninety eight fifty four. And then see extended hours is yes. Go to cancel. Then I put my stop loss and take profit. So stop loss I want to do. I can say one ninety eight. So if I say one ninety eight, see it tells me that if I do this trade, I would lose a dollar. And then I can say take profit. Um, I'll say just this, uh, now right one ninety eight. I'll say two hundred. So if it goes to two hundred and I make uh, two dollars and ninety ninety four and ninety two cents. Sorry. So now at this point, if I'm ready to place a trade, then I can hit place the trade. And now I'm I'm waiting uh, to see if these things pull back and then get me in the trade. But in most cases, if it's not working, then I can actually move it closer to it. So um, this is how I can easily move it. So if I just click on the buy order here and pull it up. Um, See, it can get me closer to where I, I want to go. For some reason, it's really slow to this lift. So let's try this one more time. I just want to get into the trade and really show you guys. So you can click, hold it, and drag it up to where you, you want it to go. Um, again, like I said, the thing is really slow today. So at that point, I have my order there. I'm waiting to get in. But hey, what if I don't want my stop loss to be right there? So again, that is something that you can fix. So right now we are in the trade. So you can see I have a stop loss and I have a, uh, a stop loss and I have a take profit. So basically I'm just gonna be observing and see, just look at where this is moving. So again, I can move this closer to where I want it. So right now, if anything would go, um, I would lose 92 cents in this trade if it went south. Uh, but I stand to making about uh, $2 in terms of profit if, if this thing was to go north. Um, again, that's just the take profit part. But how do you sec secure profit once you are in the trade? Um, once this thing move up here, I, I, I really love to show you guys. I just hope that it, is, it, it moves up in our favor. Okay, so if it moves up in our favor, basically all you have to do is, um, in this case, you can either come here uh, where it says stop loss. So what you could do is uh, click here and then do uh, modify order and then you can put in the price to update it. That's one way of doing it. But if you don't wanna be clicking and opening this form and entering the information, again, you can just click on, on the amount here on this stop loss that you have here, just click and hold and then pull it to where uh, whichever location you want it to go. So in my case, let's say if I click here and hold it, I can move it up and put it right there. So I, I reduce how much, how much loss I'm gonna take. Or oh, again, now that I'm in the money, I can see I can click it, hold it, and move it over and put it right there. So for for the most part, this is the best part that you want to be in a trade. Once um, the trade is in the point where I can secure profit, I don't have to worry about uh, getting in the red. So now this thing goes south, see it's going to kick me out of that trade. So this would be a really good example for you guys to see. Um, right now, if we hit that stop, I, I'm going to be out. There we go. That was perfectly executed. See, it took me out. And also, if there was any profit that I had, I secured my profit. And if this thing starts to run back, I am not going to be caught in, in the process. So, again, just a quick recap here, guys. This is very easy. Again, on the Weibo platform, I'm using the web app here. Um, I'm gonna, I can do a video on the desktop app. So, you can choose to use the other entry form here. In my case, I have a, a, a duck to the right here input your criteria, stop loss and take profit, or you can just right click at the price where you want and choose new order. It would then fill out the criteria here. And then uh, once you're in the trade, you can determine which direction you want to go. So this is, yeah, this is, I was really perfectly executed. So let me know in the comment section, do you um, use this um, bracket orders on the Weibo platform? And again, guys, if you are day trading, this is a very, very important tool for you to use because uh, it takes all the emotion out of the trade. So that way, um, if you turn your back, turn your head to answer a phone call, you don't turn around and, and see the thing go south. It will kick you out. And then that way you can also secure profit so that if it goes south, at least you have some money in there. So uh, in, in some cases when I'm trading fast, uh, if it's moving really fast, I don't I don't have time to go in the, putting that. I'll just buy um, and then use uh, hotkeys on my desktop and just sell. 
which is awesome. So, and that's another way that you can actually get it, but this was just a video to show you guys again, how to use bracket orders to secure profit on the Weibo platform. So let me know in the comment section if you have any questions. Um, again, if you're new, you're looking to get started, definitely check out the Weibo platform. They're doing their promotion where if you sign up now and deposit $100, you get three free stacks, one, two, three value, somewhere between uh, $8 and $1,600. So definitely give them a shot um, and see if it works out for you. And as always, guys, stay safe, stay motivated. Thank you.